So here we go then, part two of the Dream semi-final. History chasing Manchester City against the 14-time European champions, Real Madrid. The players out into a colourful cauldron of noise. It's the season... Manchester as Europe's top team tonight. It's a night where careers can be defined, epitaphs written. It's a night for players to flourish under pressure, and the road paved in gold leads directly to Istanbul. Akanji. Gundogan. Walker's going to shoot. Hasn't scored a goal in this competition for almost two years, and he's way off target with that one, the England right back. Very, very quickly. Here's Walker. Kevin De Bruyne, who is going to be able to play it back here towards Bernardo Silva. That's good defending, though, by Tony Crowe. Stones. Grealish managing to just sneak the other side of Danny Carvajal. It's in towards Bernardo Silva. It falls here for Kevin De Bruyne. It's a good ball whipped in. That's good defending, though, by Militao. And it's been a dominant start in terms of possession here for Manchester City. And those twinkling feet of Bernardo Silva getting to work. Camavinga with his work cut out on this side. Tony Kroos in there to help him. And now it's with the experienced Alaba. And the free kick, I think, here is going to be given to Real Madrid. Yeah, Bernard to Silva took umbrage with Tony Kroos. But to be honest, I think the tackle was OK. It was from Vinicius Junior on Bernardo Silva. Simon Martiniak thinks he wins the, wins the ball. You see Vinicius Junior again. This season, Inter Milan awaiting the winners of tonight's match in the final on the 10th of June in Istanbul. Here's De Bruyne. On it goes to Haaland. Great chance for Manchester City. Pulled back and nobody was there. Here's Bernardo Silva. Kyle Walker. Rodri. Onto that right foot. Opens up the space. All the way through and wide. Oh. It's been such a good start here for City. A number of issues. I thought Rodri was going to hit the same type of shot that he scored against, against Bayern Munich here. Opens up on your left foot. Now he goes right. Rodri. Now Kevin De Bruyne. It's not a bad ball in as well towards Gundogan. It was headed in there by Militao. Grealish out there against Danny Carvajal. Looking to try and slip it in here to Gundogan, who's got the possession. And they've got Haaland and De Bruyne hovering in the middle. It's a well-organised Madrid defence at the moment. Stones with the long-range shot, always drifting wide. That might be the option for Manchester City in the early going. And the applause from the manager. Yeah, it certainly is the option. Here's Stones and Bernardo Silva. Akanji. Grealish, lifted into Haaland, it's all what a stop, Courtois, and then David Alaba with a clearance, how on earth was that not 1-0? Outstanding ball in, and I think everybody inside the stadium. It's Carvajal, and now Modric. Absolutely. Short from De Bruyne to Bernardo Silva. Slightly different angle. Good delivery towards the far side of the Kanji. Oh, and no, what a save! What a save! That is absolutely world class from Courtois. What more can you say? It's going one way. Great header. Great header. Here's Walker and now De Bruyne. And they're toying with them. Bernardo Silva yeah. in! You 
Haaland, once, twice. Rodri out to the goal scorer. Drops the shoulder against Camavinga. Middle step over, it gets him away from Kroos. Here's Gundogan. Haaland with the shot! Oh! I thought that was going to rip into the top corner of the goal. It's the hardest one of the lot. I tell you, off, ca off camera when you see him for as well. Every City player so comfortable on the ball and so confident as well. Grealish gliding, gliding away, and gliding through and running and trying to play Haaland in. That was wonderful play. But there's not a lot to say in the favours that they're still in the game. 1 0's fine for them. They, they've done this many times before. We saw it at Anfield. Here's the first chance now for Vinicius to get the other side of Walker. Walker's closing speed is so impressive. In it goes now to uh, Rodrigo, who's just popped up on this side, and he's got Benzema in behind, and that's a really good goal. It's retrieved here by Vinicius Jr. Now carrying Benzema. Tony Kroos with a lot of power. Tony Kroos rattles the crossbar. What a hit from Tony Kroos. Movement, pace. Jack Grealish for Manchester City. Gundogan stepping in. There's the chance. Oh, it's two. It's two. And it's the ball. Silver again. Manchester. by Jack Grealish, who was brilliant again there. Madrid giving the ball away and rightly being punished by Manchester City yet again. The two good <laughs> to get the ball. He's got a front line with 69 goals between them this season, but they've been completely starved of any kind of service. Bernardo Silva fouled by Camavinga, he's on a hat-trick. All are they Real Madrid? They're not getting back in shape. See Vinicius Jr. just walking. They look fearful, Steve, don't they? When City have got the ball, here's Bernardo Silva, Kevin De Bruyne. Just a fraction there, too far ahead of the half Real Madrid. They haven't been able to look after it. Rodri. Here's Bernardo Silva. He's going to shoot Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva to Kevin De Bruyne and the little fingertip from Courtois, it's Gundogan, it's Haaland, <laughs> it's Akanji with the shot, it's cleared behind by Alaba. They are all over the place round the trip. Oh my word. At will, you have a shot, I'll have a shot, you have a shot. It's punched away by Courtois. And there's half time, and listen to the cheer. Guardiola stalks off, delighted by what he's seen. Real Madrid at six and sevens, ripped apart. Bernardo Silva with two goals. Best of any of them that I've seen yeah, from Real Madrid. I think so. Modric. It's a good ball to Danny Carvajal, who just momentarily was in behind. The shot by Benzema hits. Ruben Diaz and then they're helping out defensively. That's a little bit better in an attacking sense from Real Madrid, but you're clutching at straws when yeah. that's as good as it's been for them. That's a foul though. That's and a Ruben card. Diaz yellow card. Vinicius Junior was the player foul. Free kick here. Three man city wall. Alaba does hit one. Oh, he's had to save it. What a hit. And what a save from Edison. He's let the game go here. It was Bernardo Silva walking onto it? Vinicius Junior is going to be outpaced by Walker. That race has become predictable, Julian. Manchester City's passing in the first half was sublime, and supremely accurate. The movement was outstanding. They were never really hurried when they were in possession. Grealish now slipping away from Carvajal, straight forward, yellow card. Grealish is another one who's winning his individual battle out there tonight. He's been all over the field, as always, for Manchester City tonight. Whatever the opposition, whatever the occasion, he plays his game and he's away from Camavinga. 
And he almost played it to Gundogan, he's got it, Carver Haldo took it off him. Interesting change coming, Steve. We're just hearing from the benches that Antonio Rudiger is going to come on for Luka Modric. Yeah, so you would think then Alaba will go to left back. Camavinga will go central where Luka Modric plays. It's not, not a problem for Real Madrid to do that. He yeah. just want more legs around the pitch, don't he? Yeah, yellow over. Benzema's touch, letting him down. That's a lovely flick. Bernardo Silva to Kevin De Bruyne. He can power on. It's good tracking though in there by Camavinga, good midfield play by the young Frenchman. Rodri. This is all they need to do. Team in Sky Blue, just keep the ball. Oh, he's the in the back heel, Haaland's in! Oh, what a save again by Courtois! Haaland can't believe it, he thought that was number 53. It's a personal battle between goalkeeper and number nine and Courtois. Okay, Gundogan, who uh, may well get the chance to lead out Manchester City in the Champions League final in Istanbul. That's a foul by Camavinga on the chessboard one. Yeah, best of luck to them. Free kick taken by De Bruyne, oh, yes. it's gone in! It's an own goal, is it? Or did a Kenji get the last touch? It's a Matt Fletch, 3-0. As Jolien Lescott says, it doesn't matter, because that must be the moment to take Manchester City to Istanbul. Ede Militao couldn't keep it out. Manchester City get a third goal on the night. They've got a three-goal cushion on aggregate. And even Real Madrid can't come back from this. The Poznan, and they agree with you, Jolie, and they don't care who got the final touch. No, I don't think Akanji will care. And again, it's 3-0. Um, strong, strong, very strong possibility that they're going to the final. First, Steve, they've never played into Milan in a oh, competitive game before, so what a place to do it for the first time. Here's Vinicius, though, trying to get the other side. Benzema now coming in, and the goalkeeper, despite being on the ground, got the touch. Lucas Vasquez plays it back. It's Mares, Foden, on it goes to Alvarez! Manchester City are heading to Istanbul. They will play in the Champions League final against Internazionale of Milan. And they've absolutely ripped Real Madrid apart. 4 0 tonight, 5 1 on aggregate. And the gap between these two teams is so, so wide. Yeah, fantastic goal. The Champions League final. And that's it. Manchester City have done it. A warm embrace between two brilliant managers. They will go to Istanbul and they could well make history there. The champions are out and the blue moon shows, shines brighter than ever over the Etihad Stadium tonight. Manchester City have had some great nights. They haven't had many great...